Hello Mustangs and welcome to another week of home-based learning. It's hard to imagine but we are entering into week five of home-based learning and you guys have been working so hard. I appreciate hearing from your teachers the things that you're sending in and the hard work that you are putting into learning what they've sent to you. It's really great to hear all of the stories about the learning and the growing of your brain that we talk about every Monday happening even though we are still at home. A special shout out to our parents who are making all of this happen. The routines you're putting in place, the schedules you have for your kids are all supporting us as we work together to create a great learning experience for everyone amidst our closures. It was great seeing so many of you this past week at iPad deployment as the third through fifth graders got their iPads. We look forward to seeing more of you this week on Tuesday as our kindergarten through second graders get their iPads. And then Wednesday, if any of you missed that time, we look forward to seeing you then as an opportunity to get your iPad one last chance from 10 until one. We have our lost and found out on the gates. So as you're coming through on Tuesday or Wednesday, or if you already came through once and wanna take another look at the lost and found, if you're missing a jacket or a cap or maybe a lunchbox, um, those lost and found items are on hangers, they're hanging on the fence, and we hope that we can find their owners. I know it's been a month, but we really do wanna make sure that you get the clothes that are yours back home with you so that way you can use them and wear them as you were before. This week, what you'll see coming from your teachers and, and into next week will be a little bit of um, some changes, just because the state is sharing with us new information on how to best meet your learning needs. So you'll notice as your teachers send home information this week and next that it will focus a lot on reading, math, and science. And it's not to say that the other subjects aren't important, it's just that we wanna make sure that the essential learning is happening before the end of the school year. And you're doing such a great job with Miss Crooks and her art challenges, Miss Taylor's read alouds and her library pieces. Mr. Schuler has some music information he shared with you. And so I know you'll continue to do those pieces and enjoy your brain breaks and get outside and play but for right now we are going to send information home now on reading math and science and you'll also notice it may be taking a little bit less of your day so we are going to continue to send that information home on a weekly basis but you'll just notice that it's focused in on the really important work and it's also new learning so reach out to your teacher if you have any questions and let us know how it's working for you because we want to make sure that you're still able to learn and still able to be a successful student even though you are learning from your home You'll notice today I have my NEU shirt on. It is Monday and I'm wearing my NEU shirt. Next Monday, I do want to encourage you to participate in a virtual spirit day. Mondays are usually the days that we wear our college shirts and I want us to have a, a virtual spirit day next Monday where you wear some college gear. It doesn't have to be your classroom college like you might normally wear during the school year, but if you could wear a college shirt, a college hat, uh, something that is college related, send in a picture to your teacher on Seesaw or send it in to Miss Oliver at kolliver at bethelsd.org and you'll be featured as part of a slideshow showing how we still have school spirit even though we're spread far and wide throughout Roy and beyond. So again, virtual spirit day next Monday, wear your college gear or in any year gear and we will look forward to seeing those pictures come in. Again, I want to end today just by saying thank you and a special shout out to those birthday buddies for the week. Um, I know you're finding special ways to celebrate even though we are in the midst of our closure. And so continue to have those celebrations. It's important. It's your birthday. You deserve it. Uh, and thank you for continuing to partner with us and continuing to learn while we are away from one another. Again, we'll see you later this week if you have yet to pick up your iPad. Until then, Mustangs, remember teamwork makes the dream work and we'll see you next week. Have a great week.